Hi, Leo. It's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Let's see what's going on for you. Thank you, God, for blessing Leo with a clear, concise message from you. All right, guys, if you need to get in contact with me, all links are in the description box. All right, let's see what's happening for Leo this week. What is going on for Leo? So the two of cups. All right, so a good partnership, friendship, marriage, maybe even just coming back together, healing some severed tie connection. It could be it could also be in friendship, the Knight of Wands. So maybe taking fast action, swift to do something um, attractive, um, charismatic, outgoing. I heard like posting pictures or something of that nature. Seven of Wands, yeah. Could be you. That's definitely your energy, Leo. It's like you're willing to fight, you know, stand up for the advocate, you know, here. Um, maybe you're just... You're willing to fight for whatever it is you believe in. Eight of Wands. Whatever it is you're putting out. I don't know. Maybe something that you put out is controversial. The magician, it causes for, you know, thoughts or, or people to have different thoughts about, you know, subject matter. The Nine of Cups. Um, I don't know if you're finding somebody to have. You got a lot of sexual cards. So you could be having sex. King of Swords, Ace of Swords. Um, this definitely could be same-sex relationship. Or this is somebody who has not expressed their desire to maybe um, be in a same-sex relationship or have some relations with the same sex at least. Um, it's like repression. It's, uh, uh, somebody's repressing you know, their sexual desire, the sun card. Yeah. But it's like, they want it to come out. Could be you, Leo page of swords. Um, you want answers about something or there could be little communication between you and someone else. They could be spying also looking at what you're doing, but acting as if they're not the queen of swords and the king of cups. It's like you're dealing with somebody here, both you, you not on the same wavelength. Somebody is, a drinker, super emotional. They get emo or even more emotional when they drink. They get belligerent. They go over things from the past. Somebody is kind of cut off or shut off from their feelings when it comes to their their significant other, the king of swords here. Somebody doesn't want to hear it. Someone's being very strategic about their moves, about what it is they're trying to do. It's like you guys start something off trying to be um, better with one another, heal something. But at the same time, there could be little progression because I don't feel like somebody's getting the truth or somebody feels like they need to dig deeper. Somebody's also holding back their sexual desires or proclivities or what they want to go after, or someone feels sexually frustrated. Somebody wants sex more than the other person. It's like somebody wants to declare to their person, you know, how they feel and they're standing on their position. But at the same time, they can be easily moved. I don't know. Maybe by what this person says, they give some speech or they know how to put it together. They're really eloquent in what they say. It's a lot of arguing between you and someone else, whether it is like, but these are petty arguments, okay? It's like somebody wants to change this or someone's changing their mind or somebody's changing their fortune. It seems as if, as if somebody is coming up or they're getting more money or they're getting more, you know, prestige or eyes on them. They are um, changing, changing their mind about the relationship or about wanting to be in a relationship. Somebody feels like a relationship is stagnant. We get the eight of pentacles and the eight of wands here. There could be an argument, a fight, especially if somebody gets drunk. Oh, yeah. Because then someone's going to want to confront. All right, let's see what the other cards have to say. What do we have to say for Leo? It's a lot going on here, Leo. Um, okay, complexity. Quin I don't know how to pronounce this word. Something irritates, puzzles, mystifies, make curious. We just, we saw that somebody's getting really uh you know curious about what's going on. Requires translation. 
So it's like somebody wants somebody to speak the truth. We talked about that. Like somebody feels like they're not getting the truth, so they get to do more investigation. Somebody gets curious. This could even be coming from insecurity, pettiness, um, lack of communication because it turns into argument, drama, wishes, hopes, someone needing to be more romantic, someone wanting more sex in a relationship, someone is feeling like, why are they being denied? Pluto, transformation, renewal, inner resources, basic instinct, rec recognition, taboo. Yeah, somebody could be thinking about that same sex relationship. They feel like it's taboo. They're trying to sub subverge it or uh, subversion or submerge it, okay? Uh, motivation, intensity, death, cycles. So it's like someone is realizing, is this coming to an end? Is this relationship coming to an end? Or do we need to put it to an end? Yeah, the 11th house, friendship. We talked about friendship, group activity, community, humanity, rebellion, exper uh, experimentation, the future, a tribe. So it's like somebody just needs to go maybe their own way, do their own thing. The 10th house, somebody's getting a lot of recognition, responsibilities, achievement, you know, for being competent in their um field and their mind is changing the pay uh, the, uh, the patriarchy the empire the legacy notoriety yeah it's like somebody's getting all of that because and now somebody's mind is changing about a relationship or whatnot this is what i have for you uh leo if it resonates let me know how it resonates down in the comment section go over to the website book there ask a question or two by texting it to the number below you can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy ella coffee link uh, catch me live again every tuesday thursday and sunday night 9 30 p.m eastern standard time click the subscribe and the bell button so that you know when i'm going live and you can ask questions thank you guys take care many blessings to you